Welcome back to the channel, Spicy 4K Action here. Thank you for joining me on another video. We got another awesome unboxing to do for you guys today. It's been a couple of days since my last video, but first, first things first, I need you to go down to Wilkie's Movies and Music. Uh, Corey over there is just an awesome dude. Just started his channel, uh, just created his first video yesterday. Uh, I will leave a link down below in the description as well as a link to his channel. Go over there and subscribe. This guy is a huge supporter of all things physical media. I see him commenting on like every video of mine. I see him commenting on every video of all my friends and uh, blue tubers, 4K reviewers. Uh, every live chat I'm in, he's he's there. I, this guy supports everyone, and I think the community needs to come together and support him. Uh, looks like he's going to be doing some fantastic stuff uh, with uh, a movie club. He's got lots of cool ideas. Um, so definitely give him a shout out. Go go like his video. Go comment, and definitely go subscribe. Corey's an awesome dude, and I'm happy that he's uh, he's part of the community uh, and taking the plunge into YouTube. So. Uh, Hoping to see uh, a lot more coming from him in the very near future. So super exciting there. So that's the first things first. Now we're going to do the 4K Steelbook uh, unboxing and a partial review. I did watch this last night of the Shout Factory Best Buy exclusive for the 1988 film Pumpkinhead. And yeah, this is this not the Steelbook art of the year? This is just absolutely fantastic fantastic looking uh as soon as i saw this get you know announced i pre-ordered it this this is just freaking crazy looking i'm gonna show you the spine here pumpkin head it's a two disc set 4k and a blu-ray love the continuation of that i mean this is just incredible the only gripe i have of course is this down here at the bottom but they seem to do that on all the shout factory steel books but yeah this this is just incredible I'll show you the inside artwork here really really nice looking yeah just a beautiful beautiful release uh if you're a fan of this film I'll show you the disc art for the uh, 4k here got pumpkin head there in all its glory and then we have the the blu-ray so uh very nice looking set uh you know being that it's shout factory they got a ton of special features on here i'm not familiar with the blu-ray release of this so uh some of these could be ported over but if you're not if you don't know about this film you need to definitely check it out it's a great creature feature from the late 80s this is a directorial debut for stan winston yes the special effects guy the guy did all the monsters it seems like yeah he was part of aliens he he helped on predator he did the terminator he did terminator 2 this is his first movie as a director uh and it doesn't disappoint it's like i said it's a great creature feature it's really short it's only 86 minutes long uh this transfer looks fantastic um i had only seen this on tv when i was a little kid and it scared the absolute shit out of me uh this creature is creepy looking and it's it's the 80s it's all real you know they made this creature it's not cgi at all uh very uh awesome looking monster the one that creeped me out like i said but um this is just a stacked release from shout factory i mean you got the 4k of course dolby vision on that uh you get the audio commentary with a few of the the crew on that as well but the blu-ray is where it shines as, as far as special features um you're getting you know uh interviews with the co-writer interview with the actor uh the boy with the glasses so there's there's a lot of different interviews here if you're really into that uh but where, what i really loved and enjoyed watching um was this six-part documentary on the making of the film called pumpkin ed on earth as as mentioned it is six parts but it's an hour and three minutes long and i watched all of it it, it was great it gave me a bunch of insight onto this movie but also uh, it seemed newer. Like I, I don't. It doesn't say that it's brand new, so I'm guessing the 4K release of this or or the Blu-ray release of this had this and they ported it over. But it must have only just been a couple of years ago. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot going on here. Um, remembering the Monster Kid, a tribute to Stan Winston. They have a look at the creation of the pumpkin head action figure. They have behind the scenes footage. There's the list just goes on and on. I'll show it here if you want to take a look at it. Read it for yourself. Uh, if you're not familiar with this movie, essentially uh, some some kids, teenagers from uh, from the city go to this small town to to camp. Uh, 
you know, they they start to ride their motorcycles. There's an accident involving one of the the country's kids, um, and basically this the dad of the kid uh, goes to this creepy lady's house and basically wants to wreck vengeance on these kids for uh, hurting his kid. I won't spoil anything in this movie, essentially, but uh, uh, it evokes Pumpkinhead, uh, and yeah. He basically goes after these these teenagers that uh, were a part of this accident involving motorcycles. And that, that was one of the parts I, I just forgot about this film was just the whole beginning um, showing all the old CRF and, and even the uh, the Kawasaki motorcycle they had. So I really enjoyed that. I'm a big dirt biker myself. Um, but yeah, uh, you know, there's definitely, you know, things I could, you know, poke holes in in, in, in this movie. But all in all, it's just a great creature feature, one I enjoyed. Um and yeah, it was a lot of fun. Uh, and like I said, the transfer looked great. Uh, yeah, I mean, the main guy, I can't think of his name, but he's been in like everything. He's in The Terminator. He's in Near Dark. I mean, I looked at his filmography and it just goes on for days. Um, but uh, yeah, Pumpkinhead on 4K. Highly recommend if you're a fan of the film. Great movie for October. Again, just show one more time. But I had an absolute blast with this. Uh, and yeah, I would highly recommend if you're into the film. Um, let me know down in the comments what you think of Pumpkinhead. Have you seen any of the sequels? I think they were made for TV. I'm not sure, but I have not seen any of the sequels. I know they came a little bit after the release of this. Um, you know, this wasn't a big budget, you know, blockbuster by any means. Uh, it's definitely kind of found a cult following uh, these days. But uh, I remember watching it on TV back in the day. So seeing it in all its glory... Uh, was absolutely fantastic and yeah, just night and day difference as far as the transfer goes uh, with Shout Factory. But yeah, let me know what you think of Pumpkinhead, what you think of Stan Winston. Obviously, he's just a freaking genius when it comes to uh, you know creating monsters and, and animatronics. I mean, he was part of Jurassic Park. I mean, he's part of pretty much everything. It seems like anything that was cool, uh, Stan Winston was a part of. He redid The Predator uh, after, you know, the first renditions of him and actually made him look like a badass and what you see in the film. Um, so yeah, legendary stuff. Um, rest in peace. Stan Winston passed away, I think in 2008, but, uh, yeah, really, really enjoyed this movie. Let me know your comments down below on what you think of this steelbook. Is this the best steelbook artwork of the year? What gives a run for its money? Are you picking this up? Are you picking up just the normal, uh, slipcover edition of this let me know in the comments below it is not sold out uh this is still available if you're looking to get it i think it is even a couple dollars cheaper when i checked this morning at 34.99 i think i paid 38 but yeah uh just absolutely incredible release and uh one i'm really happy to have in the collection and uh yeah thank you guys for the support thanks for watching this video uh and uh yeah we will see you guys all in the next one i hope everyone has a great day great rest of their week and yeah, peace out.